I think we'll start this out with the tap. We got a helper chain as you're going to have a tap. Oh, you grab by the function. Oh, yeah, right. we might be wrong. <laughs> <laughs> We're funny, but not always a tap. <laughs> there you are. Might as well come and join you. Anyway, so we've been doing all sorts of stuff, uh, but I figure it's time to talk about the, uh, what is, shall we say, um, measuring behavior, right? There's lots of behavior that we can measure, you know, uh, but ultimately speaking, there's ways that we have to think about measuring behavior. So when we think about initially about measuring behavior, we want to think about three things. Repeatability, right? These are the dimensions that we're going to worry about. So repeatability, okay, I don't know if I can say that again, repeatability, repeatability, meow. Um, we can then think about temporal extent, all right? Um, and then we can also think about temporal locus, okay? So extent, repeatability, pretty obvious. Temporal extent, how long does this go on in time, right? Um, the extent, and then um, temporal locus, location, where are we at? And I'm sure by now you guys have figured out where we're at. We do a lot of recording in Spokane for now. Um, so it's kind of fun, but hey, they got all these really cool things to worry about. So meow, let's take a look at some of the behavior that we can work with because we're really talking about measuring behavior, right? So we can dance around like this and do all sorts of things. That really has nothing to do with what I'm talking about, but I just figured I would because it sounded kind of fun, meow. Um, ultimately, meow, we have to think about that how we're going to do the measuring meow. Number one is count, right? How often, meow, does the behavior happen, meow? Um, that is a very, very basic one. One that's more important to us is often rate or frequency. Um, they're different, but we're not gonna really differentiate right now, okay? So rate frequency, we're just gonna, it's a count over time, meow. Um, the next thing that we wanna think about is duration, meow. How long is meow a behavior going on for? Um, it could be going on for a long time. That's our duration. Uh, in a response time, meow, uh, meow, meow, I mean meow. Well, in a response time is the time between the responses, meow, um, which is something that we often worry about, uh, about the frequency and over time, which also gets us to that inner, the IRT stuff. Um, folks, I'm hesitating a little bit right now, meow, because I want you to understand, meow, that um, there's an entire set of videos just on this. So please go watch our other videos on each one of these topics. We have some great examples that go along with them. Uh, we got some other things here that we need to think about when we're talking about measurement. We also want to focus on, uh, uh, let's see, magnitude. We could measure how intense meow the response is, meow. Um, so we have that sort of responding along with it. The inner response time, magnitude, uh, duration, count, frequency, Brad, am I missing anything else? Latency. Latency is the time from the stimulus till the time. Uh, sorry, another thing that we can measure uh, about behavior is the latency of the response, right? So how long it takes the response to occur from the time that the prompt happens. So you know, if Brad says, hey, Ryan, start a video, and I go like this. Oh, now it's time to start a video. That's kind of a fairly long latency. Or if Brad says, hey, Ryan, start a video. And I go, right now I start getting into my videos and blah, 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 blah. And I start doing my lecture. See the difference there, response latency. So again, folks, watch our other videos on these. They're much more in depth. Uh, the little uh, Penny Packer Pedance videos. Um, and remember that we work as a team, Meow, and Meow, and you're eventually going to realize, Meow, that what we're doing with this video is also setting up some other Meow videos. And hopefully we can even start Meow breaking this down into Meow something that you will be able to have some fun with for inner observer um, agreement stuff. All right. So anyway, more on all that stuff later. I'm going to go play on some blocks. Bye.